All right, what's up, guys? So by now, you probably heard the buzz all over your social media. Everybody posting all these chat rooms and uh, collaboration rooms and talking about Clubhouse. And you're thinking, what the hell's going on? And what's up with this club thing? No, it's not that type of clubhouse. Clubhouse is a platform in which you could bounce ideas, collaborate, you know, share different perspectives, chat in real time, and really what puts the media on social media without all that fancy equipment, which is you just talking to people, socializing. So clubhouse is definitely the new hotspot. But with that, there's a couple rules you want to follow. Well, technically not really rules, because if you don't want to follow them, you don't have to. But chances are that you being more involved in rooms and getting asked to participate or you be a moderator or just probably get on stage will get a lot harder. But for you to get seen and get out there, you might want to follow some of these tips. Tip number one, listen, when you first sign up for Clubhouse, all you want to do is listen, check out as many rooms as you want, pull out your interests, find the rooms that are more appealing to you, follow some of the people I mentioned below that have moderated some great rooms with a ton a million dollars worth of value inputted on some of these talks that you usually won't find anywhere else unless you're paying a lot of money so you want to follow them just listen get a feel of how the movement goes how the questions are being answered and uh, just enjoy it at that that way from the beginning like just enjoy the experience tip number two is if you have a business know your numbers there are some panels, there are some rooms in which they will invite you to talk about your business. It might be that you have a question in regards to how you could scale. It might be that you need to collaborate with somebody or you have something of value to offer to somebody. Knowing your stuff and knowing your number is very important. I've been in many rooms already where you have people come up and they have the opportunity to pitch to millionaires who are willing to invest and they absolutely have no idea about their business know your numbers you do not want to be that one person that gets the opportunity to pitch your business in front of damon john from shark tank and you have absolutely no idea what your numbers what your strategy is what you sold what you gross what you net expenses i mean it's just gonna look really bad so they are going to be opportunities in which you could pitch something you have to be prepared tip number three Start your own rooms, get creative, find something that excites you. It doesn't necessarily always have to be business, but if you just start a room with a topic that's catchy, you'd be surprised. I've been in rooms where it'd be two people and the, the subject was so catchy and so captivating that within seconds, it grew to 500 or 140 people. It doesn't matter. The fact that you're starting getting known out there and the the great thing about this whole thing is people get to hear you. You actually get to speak. So they get a different understanding. Unlike social media, where it's just your pictures and whatever you're posting. I mean, here they actually get to listen to your perspective, your opinion, your takes on things. And you'd be surprised how that can lead to a lot better connections that you most likely wouldn't find anywhere else. So with that said, follow me on Clubhouse at DJP Pena. I also included some of the top moderators down below who are absolutely killing it in every room that I've been in. Everything from multifamily investing, commercial investing, uh, you know, JVs, private equities, marketing. I mean, I'm telling you, these guys are solid. Go follow them as well. And I'll catch you in the next room.